Hi there, my name's Joe and in this video I'll be teaching you how to get started on tracking dependencies in Jira plans. So what are dependencies? So in projects, some tasks can't start until others are finished. These relationships are called dependencies. So these are critical to delivering work smoothly, especially when multiple teams are involved. So Jira plans makes it easy to visualize, manage and resolve dependencies. So you can spot blockers early and keep your projects moving forward. They can be visualized in both the timeline view as well as the dependencies view. So in the timeline view, you can see how work is connected across your plan uh, through these arrows and lines. And what you can do is you can actually map them on the timeline as well. So for example, I'm going to map port five, this task here, across to another project to this epic called give three. And as you can see, that dependency has been marked here. Once you've done that, you can click Save Changes. Yep. And you can also filter by dependencies if you want a clearer view of what's happening. So for example, here, you can filter by has dependencies. There's other types of views of, of filters you can use, such as overlapping dates and specific work item. And obviously you can keep playing around with it. You can group by team. Um, you can filter by certain teams. Uh, you can group by spaces as well, just to visualize things a little bit better. You can also hone in into the dependencies view, which gives a focused look on all of the dependencies on your plan. And you can play around with the filters here. So you can roll up to pillars, initiatives, features, stories, subtasks. Um, you can also roll up to teams as well, see what's going on between different teams. And obviously you can group by, um, you can choose the spaces, sprints, can choose specific work items just to view the, the dependencies of a specific work item and you can look at different types of links obviously from here you can still create dependencies so we can create one here and say it is blocked by something from another space and that creates it and obviously you click save changes so this is really powerful because imagine your marketing team is preparing for a major product launch uh, several tasks need to happen in a specific order and some depend on work from other teams for example the marketing campaign can't go live until the new product landing page is built by the web team the landing page can't be published until the design team design team delivers final graphics or the press release can't be sent until legal has approved the, the messaging so by mapping these dependencies in Europe plans you can see exactly where delays might occur and coordinate with other teams to keep everything on track so by using dependency tracking in Jira plans, your teams can stay aligned, avoid last minute surprises and deliver projects on time. Uh, good luck with managing your dependencies and please reach out if you have any uh, problems or questions. Thanks for watching.